Already in January this year, the works on Newton Brider Adventures movie will begin. This time, however, it will be a reboot of the known series without Angela Jolie in the title role. The movie will tell the story of young Lara Croft during her first adventure. I don't know about you, but I love to see the main character in action on the big screen again. For a while now, there are rumors around stating that the new main character of next Star Wars spin-off will be Boba Fett. The film was supposed to be directed by Josh Trunk, however after Fantastic Four premiere, he needed to step aside from the project. According to Entertainment Weekly, Boba Fett will show up in the third movie of Star Wars Anthology. As of now, neither the plot nor the director are known. It turns out that the Batman movie, that was supposed to enter production phase in spring this year, might not even come to existence at all. The role of the director, screenwriter and the main actor was supposed to be taken by Ben Affleck, that currently is not convinced if this project will ever reach the cinemas. He claims that script has not been written yet, and the plot at this time is in the planning phase. In November this year, Thor Ragnarok will have its premiere. If you've seen Doctor Strange to the very end, you probably know that play by Benedict Cumberbatch character will show in the mention production. Now we have the official confirmation. In the newest Thor adventure, we will be able to see Thor, of course, Doctor Strange and Hulk. This movie might be really spectacular. In one of the interviews, Ryan Reynolds admitted that he would gladly play in a Wolverine and Deadpool adventure movie. However, so far, it is very unlikely that this type of movie will be made. It is all because Wolverine actor Hugh Jackman still claims that his appearance in Logan will be his farewell if it comes to X-Men movies. In the last year, there was some information about plans regarding Slenderman. Now, however, producers finally started working on the project. Film has a director, so it looks like we'll be hearing more about this production soon. Known for Dr. House, Hugh Laurie will become one of the characters in new comedy about Sherlock and Watson. Holmes and Watson will be directed by Ethan Cohen. Project, however, will be produced by Sony Pictures Studios. It will be nice to see Dr. House in the role of Sherlock Holmes. For now, we still don't know which character he will play. According to some rumors that show up on the internet, in June Marvel will start the production phase for the second part of Ant-Man. As of now, we don't even know who will be the enemy of the main character. Since the filming is about to start, we can expect more information about the movie soon. So is he crazy? He believes he's mentally ill. But he may be the most powerful mutant we've ever encountered. They're coming and they're gonna kill you. As it can be seen, TV shows about superheroes are still popular. This time not Netflix, but FX will introduce the new story. Plot will be presented in a slightly different way. This time the show will focus on the son of Professor Javier, that when still young was diagnosed with schizophrenia. I'll definitely watch it as soon as first episodes are released. Good news for the fans of Expendables. It looks like we are about to see the fourth part of Not So Expendable Saga. Distribution rights for the film were bought by the same company that acquired them for the previous three releases. Premiere of the fourth and the last part is set for year 2018. In year 2016, like in the last years, the most downloaded TV show was The Game of Thrones. What is interesting is that the series keeps this top position for last four years. If it comes to the most downloaded movie in 2016, competition didn't have chance with Deadpool that till this day keeps the popularity. In today's episode, that's all. If you liked the video, don't forget about the rating and the comment. Remember to subscribe using the button below. See you in the next episode.